and welcome back to just wing it hey look at this all right we are at the field where i put the uh my favorite one of my favorite uh runways the winds are coming there is some pretty good winds you can see the the pine tree here blowing the winds are pretty good but they're coming right down the pipe so i think we should be good we got a friend elephant mountain out there in the sun and oh by the way um now you can see why it's called Elephant Mountain. You can see this little head thing there to the right side. You see the little hump. So that's why they call it Elephant Mountain because it kind of looks like an elephant. <laughs> uh, anyway, hey, we have the new Horizon Hobby just recently released. Anyways, in the last you know week or so, the new Horizon Hobbies uh, E-Flight Cessna Citation. Okay, I'm flying mine without safe. A couple of things real quick. Some admin notes. For, well, first. Prayers and thoughts go out to all those affected by the COVID-19 pandemic and all of those that are under lockdown. I hope that you find these videos informative, entertaining, and give you a, a welcome break from the stress of what's going on in these times. And again, thoughts and prayers to those who are really affected with loss of, of friends, loved ones, etc. <clears throat> so, some admin notes on this plane. I just flew the maiden flight. I've got three minutes remaining off of a five minute timer. I set mine to, to five minutes. I have an Electron Pro 950 milliamp, three cell battery, 30 C. Um, and I just checked the battery and there were 70% remaining. So I only burned 30% from a two minute flight. What affects to be a two minute flight with several high speed passes. So that's the kind of battery use you can expect. Oh, and just so you understand, when you find this model right out of the box, the safe is activated or deactivated vis-a-vis -vis the gear selector. On my DX6, it happens to be the A switch right here. So when I have it forward or towards me, position one, don't know if you can see that, I hope you can. Position one, the safe is off. If I flick this thing that way, so you hear it? So safe is safe is on. I'm gonna fly mine safe off. I just I I actually flew this thing. Uh, can you hear me? Can you hear me over those, those motors? <laughs> I actually flew this thing the first couple of flights and I had the safe on and I uh, actually had a little bit of a mishap because of that, believe it or not. I had a bit of a mishap um, because I wasn't, you, uh, you're going to laugh, because I wasn't used to flying with safe and the thing wasn't turning sharp enough. Anyway, we'll cover that here. Uh, we'll cover that here soon. So let's go. All right. So just throttle up, give her full throttle, and away she goes. This plane really, really flies nice. It really does. Um... So I don't know why she's got this weird kind of oscillation at, at half throttle, but she does. Nice. Wow. Boy, but I tell you though, this thing does fly good. Um, it really does. So let's let's do a downwind for you. Um, so here we go. Let's see if I can I can th thread the needle here. <laughs> Oh my god, it's hilarious how fast it is. It's a business jet and it flies like a fire plane. <laughs> okay, so I was wondering about the 30 millimeter fans. I was talking to a good buddy of mine yesterday, as a matter of fact, and uh, I was saying, I don't know why they went to 30 millimeter fans, you know, when uh, they could have probably flown this plane on the 28s that were in the uh, A 10, I, I, I think. But, anyways. Uh, oh, there's a roadrunner out there. I can't, I can't watch him, but there's a roadrunner out there. Neat. Let's do a, let's do a roll. I don't know, hopefully you can see it. That's pretty fast. That's really fast. I don't like doing my rolls like that. I am getting some oscillation though. I don't know if that's because of the wind, because of the 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 stab. The stab is a full flying stab, and I know you're not getting much on video because you know here's this this little tiny EDF jet. You know, zipping by like Mach three. So let's. So yeah, I think I think she's just fighting the wind. I don't think there's anything wrong with the motors per se. 
Um, I'm down to a minute remaining, so let's see if I can put her down, and we'll do a battery check for you, okay? So I'm down below uh, half, and let's... Nice, I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't like bouncing, but there is a bit of a, a spring in in the uh, step, if you will, of this plane. Um, and hey, you know, uh, hey, another flight in the books, and she's down in one piece. So the baby is still in one piece. So let's do a little 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 parade presentation taxi here. God, hear how loud this thing is! Whoa! Let's aileron into the wind. Okay, and we're gonna get her. We're gonna get her over here by the car. Okay. Got here a lot. <laughs> oh my God, it's kind of comical. All right, so here we have uh, the the new Horizon Hobby, a uh, UMX, uh, ooh, uh, CHP. So California Highway Patrol, they operate uh, Cessna, they do uh, freeway patrol and so forth. Okay, so there you go. Um, so let's check this out. Let's show you what we got. We're down to one minute remaining. So in other words, we have flown officially four minutes um, out the battery. It's a little warm. Okay. Don't know if you can see that. 34%. Hopefully you can see that. It'll look normal here and 35% remaining okay so 35% on my uh, electron pro it's a 950 milliamp battery the, they recommend an 800 so if I'm down to 35% which by the way is very much uh, acceptable um, after four minutes I'd say it, if there were no winds that I was fighting um, that if it was calmer conditions, perhaps, I could probably get a solid five minutes out of this. So I'm not gonna change my, my timer setting. Um, and oh, by the way, uh, it is a bit windy, but I, I'm looking at my box right now and I did not set any trims in this thing at all. It's flying really good. So good job, Horizon. So real quick, after uh, flight two, I think that that full flying stab, and you can see it is a full flying stab, but it's kind of wonky. It's a little loose in there, so that might be a third critique. So one, the battery tray, you got to go in there and, and apply some foam safe CA to that battery tray to get that thing down. Uh, <clears throat> two, the only appliques or the decals or decals for my friends in the UK uh, that are, are, are a bit off were the tail marking numbers and for some weird reason they're on Fakaka maybe so I just took them off and I might even put some different stickers on there I don't know and then I guess a third critique would be that that again that that stab is really really wonky there's just there's just one spar in there kind of holding it that it pivots off of so I, I think yep it pivots off this one spar the servo, there's your servo channel. You can see the, you see the servo channel. So it pivots, and you know, eh, it's minor. The thing flies, but I, I, you know, I don't know if that affects the flight more than the winds that I'm flying in today or not. I like being right here at the car because it's blocking the wind right now. So hopefully you don't hear a lot of crosswind. So that being said, thank you for joining me here at the field today. Again, I hope you find these videos uh, informative, entertaining, and I, it gives you a good idea about what to expect with your Horizon Hobbies and E-Flight UMX Citation. Uh, again, thoughts and prayers go out to all those affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. Uh, you know, and and we're going to get through this as a global community, as as people. We're going to get through this, and I think I, we really see the light at the end of the tunnel. So hey, uh, blue skies, happy landings, cheers, and all the best from just wing it. And thanks for tuning in to watch the UMX citation. Give me a thumbs up, a like if you like it, um, and and. 
I appreciate the subscriptions. So, so that said, again, all the best and cheers from Just Wing It at the field with the Horizon Hobbies UMX uh, citation. Cheers.